Morning, everyone. So, another one from the collection. Let's uh, get into it. This here is my WPL C24. It is a 16th scale or 18th scale four wheel drive crawler. Now it's got a little Toyota hard body on it, a little removable cap, battery tray is right here, hidden away, and I've added a couple of 3D printed items to it with my coolers and a Bulbasaur, because why not, right? So, I don't know why, but I decided I wanted to pick up one of these because I want, wanted a little Toyota just to mess around with that wasn't tenth scale. And, I mean, it's alright. It it does what it do, it's supposed to. I mean, it's a small scale crawler, it's four wheel drive, it's pretty much un, unstoppable in anything that you know would be for its scale. Trying to drive it in long grass, it, it does decently until it gets stuck or gets hung up on something on the underneath. The underside, it's just kind of your basic crawler chassis. It's got headlights that work. Um, it's, you know, four wheel drive, blocked diffs so that way, you know, it doesn't get stuck on anything, which it really doesn't. I mean, unless you're trying to do stuff with this thing that is, you know, meant for 10 scale trucks. No, it, it really does pretty well. It's got the turning radius of a semi truck, though. So, it doesn't turn very well. I mean, that's, about, that's as far as it goes. It, it's, it's steering is not very, uh, you know, it's not one of the upsides. But, it looks really good. And for what it, the size it is, it does pretty well. And it's it's taken a bit of a beating. It's already tumbled off of you know some tables at work, and a couple of small scratches on the roof. That's about it. It's one of them trucks. If you got an indoor course you can use, or you just want something you can play around with inside, it'll work. It's not very fast. It's a crawler, so of course it's not going to be super fast, but it it's fun. You know, not exactly what I you know, normally use or normally drive, but it's pretty fun. It's a fun little truck. I picked it up on Amazon for uh, 65 or 70 bucks. So overall, these things aren't very expensive and they work pretty well. Thanks for watching. Feel free to like, subscribe, comment. You know, if you have any questions, you can reach me at any of the social medias linked below.